percentage of the U.S. population that's foreign-born, meaning first-generation immigrants, is about 12%. Pittsburgh is 3%, and it's falling. People have different color skin, they have different shaped eyes, they're not like us, they don't speak the same language, we should fear them. That they come and they steal jobs. It's remarkable that all the 9-11 terrorists were documented. I mean, and, and somehow we're transferring that burden to a Mexican on a bicycle who's going from his restaurant, his construction job to his restaurant job. Crime rates are no higher among foreign-born uh, Americans than they are about native-born Americans. I, had a, I had actually had a lady, an Italian-American lady in my street say to me that every Asian who comes to the America gets a new car. Are you out of your mind? <laughs> I think it's the major mission of this country is to, is to take in your huddled masses. The Irish that were coming from the famine, the Italians that were coming from political strife, the Jews that were fleeing Eastern, uh, fleeing Europe, we're, we're the harbor, we're the refuge. And Pittsburgh is such a great example of, of a city that was, that was founded by immigrants. And what is it that has shifted? Pennsylvania has the third highest corporate net income tax in the country. Well, then why are we surprised when people don't want to set up plants over here? And the fact that there are absolutely no international flights. So we can talk about this till we're blue in the face, but as long as, you know, if nobody comes forward and gives these organizations money to, to get yeah. this different, you know, we're, we're just going to be doing this. Pittsburgh area's got 4,000 foreign foreign-born graduate students, mostly at CMU and Pitt, but also at all the other universities. And, and many of them would like to stay if they could get jobs. People want to come here. They want to come here, but they feel there, there are no opportunities up here. Regions and cities that have embraced immigration, that get it about the positives of immigration, those are the areas that are growing. The number of people who want to come to the United States is in the billions. You know, and so they're, they're out there at all levels of income and skill and they would much rather be here and if they knew about Pittsburgh they'd much rather be in Pittsburgh than where they are. You know we keep using bridges as metaphors over here in this region and that really is going to be the key to our future just like it was a hundred years back. Mm -hmm.